Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes of Mind Magic 3 Shadow of Death. We are still in the second scenario of Jem's campaign. Jem is looking very good and she has a big army. We have been able to kill a lot of undead units already. Straker over here has a much weaker army than we have, even though it might not look like it, but definitely he does. And we are also going to build uh, our own undead army. Look, we have Dragon Vault right here. I think I'll even hire these two so that if there is a week of or a month of plague or something, we will not lose those two units. And now we are going also after the monolith that will bring us on the other side like this. And now we can go and try to take this town. I don't know which way is easier. Oops, we might not be able to get there. Oh, we are once one freaking step short. Are you kidding me? Well, that's fine because we still on day one will be able to get there, right? Yeah, you know what? Actually, we can reload and uh, here and we can leave uh, these guys at home you know like or I can actually leave everything at home and be a lot quicker right that's what we didn't do that's what I should have done Yes, because there is there is there will be nobody going after us. So this is this is perfect now. Next turn, I guess the same thing happens. Yes, uh, but now we have more movement. Coronius can go and bring uh, our army like this. We will still build a Dragon Vault, maybe a bit later. We'll see what the other ones have as well. You can learn a lot of spells, that's always good. And you will have one quick Silver Pegasi, by the way. As well, because you will be able to move a lot quicker. Gem, now with extra speed, can go and... Uh, reach that town, right? Oh, there is a hero there now? Found. Huh. Why he was not there before? That's intriguing, but okay. So let's put them together. One and two like this. They will be sacrificed. Uh, but I think we should be more than fine. Glorious victory. Okay. Endless purse of gold. Yay. How much? 500 per day. And now we can get the town. Like what? Galfran. How did you do that? Oh, now you have 60 mana. That's how. Okay. I think um, I don't need to protect too much. Yeah, I think that's fine. Now, destroy undead would be great, but this is the biggest stack, so I will chip it with chain lightning. That's much better. Now we can block them. You can wait. And he's losing his uh, his mana to blind. It's always nice to see. You can go forward. And... Huh. Well, stay where you are, and you, 
And I think now we do destroy undead and, and this as well. Or I can also try to... Hmm. Oh, he's immune to destroy undead. <laughs> Seriously? Dude, that's unexpected. Frost ring? That doesn't work very well. Hmm. Okay. I can, you know what? I can just... Uh, no, I still need to. I still need to kill them. Wait, wait. Oh yeah, that's how he does it. Okay. Fine. Fine. I'm going next and you're gonna die. GG. 333, that's alright. Pendant of Death. And let's go inside. Maybe we can even build level 4 here. Nothing new. Death Ripple maybe. Oh no, can't build level 3. Okay, that sucks. Uh, this one does not have a drag... Uh, we can't build even a Hall of Darkness. Okay, so it's going to be the Dragon Vault in the first town. And in this one, potentially, if we can scrape some more money... 10 and 10 and 6,000. Hmm. I don't think we can, to be honest. I don't think we can, but let's make ourselves quick at least. Uh, so that we can reach uh, the next town next day. Or potentially we can even at least scout. Yeah, let's scout. We have enough money. So let's scout. You get one um, quicker guy, probably, in case you survive by some kind of accident. And let's go and have a look. How far is it? It's probably far. So we will not get it day one. Yeah, we will not get it day one, which is okay. Well, it's not okay, but it's... we can survive it. So this guy dies anyway to Clavius. Okay, but at least we got the town soon-ish. That's all right. Okay, so... Seven... and five... and build a hole of darkness. Because it's day seven, it, it totally makes sense. It totally makes sense. And buy them in case there's plague. Even here, if we still have money. Yes, we do. Okay. Very good. Replenishing mana, very important. Morale, we do want to use. Destroy undead. This, we have a better one, better one. What is this? Cost of surrendering, we do not want to surrender. That's all right. Okay, and now the question is, can anybody do anything else? You can flag that and go back home. And maybe we can send another hero from here over there. Oh no, we can actually go via her to him. Or maybe I should have sent the entire army. 
so that that hero doesn't get killed. Do you think that makes sense? We can totally try that. I believe the biggest threats are already gone. Let's try it out. I mean, if, did, if that works, it could be a big deal, right? So, take everything. Even this guy. Don't take him. Okay, don't take him either. For Grim, and uh, you can go... And give the army to Elishar. Yes. Bam. Elishar at least has some spells. Yes, he does. And this army, and maybe this army will be able to scare them off and then we can take the town on day one. Yeah, that's a very good idea. And you can now just stay here and, uh, and split them. Don't die. <laughs> Don't die. Very good. Next turn. We suffer a defeat, that's fine. And now let's take uh, everything. Like this, you have already taken that, you have taken that. And look, LSR can probably go there. LSR can probably go there and we can even maybe do more. Let's replay enemy turn, by the way. He went up, he went up, right? Yes, he did. So, big adventure now. Yeah, we can totally take the town. Look at us. Look at us. So, speed 5, speed 4. Let's kill him. And uh, let's uh, kill him. Nice. And look, all the army is still there. Perfect. Just beautiful. Just beautiful. Can we build a... No. Level 4 is still not allowed. Okay, so we have all the towns. Now we need to poor man's town portal her. That's not allowed, by the way, but one can dream. And the question is, how do we, how do we continue? We do want to keep... No, first we take the army from this town, I believe. Yes, so hmm. I want three stacks, but I don't have enough for three stacks. So maybe we don't take the shooters, or maybe we don't take the vampires. Hmm. How much? 5,000, 8,000, 11,000. Okay, we can take a hero. Like this guy. And uh, switch the army. Switch the artifacts as, as well. He does have artifacts, doesn't he? Or did she? Yeah, she, she kept the artifacts. Okay, that's fine. So now... One, two, and you'll keep the slow guys as well, Elishar, so that we can hire them as well. And with that kind of army, 
you will be protecting and you will go back Ryland you can actually go to over here yes switch be quicker next time and four grim can go back and give stuff to her come on uh, four grim there you are very nice so switch the undead will be on you you will be guarding right you will have more undead from here and now we go and try to try to go through the garrisons maybe with this army is that possible it is possible and if we lose the army we will replace it with undead yeah that's the plan right so this army is okay one stacks like this you protect them they come to us I think that's the plan okay so how what's the easiest way to get here through here right yes we just need to go kill everything here which will be a challenge actually I might need my undead troops as well because it's like five to nine dragons that's a lot of dragons 380 only I might not even have enough hmm Yeah, you can protect like that. LSR. That should be doable. This guy protects here. I just need more money now, don't I? You can take the town. Yes, you can. And that will force him to go back. No, let's try not losing anybody. Okay. <laughs> very good back back and here okay advanced earth and go back <laughs> that was fun uh, what else you can go no you can go Genova over here very nice another thousand and you can go stay there he will go after the town again and this will allow us to catch him i can trade resources for another hero if i need to maybe even kill him you know if i am successfully able to go through here i can potentially kill him So many options okay so first let's see if i can win this with my normal army it might be actually hard or impossible let's try victory so it's not impossible interesting i thought that would be 
kind of hard, but okay. So let's bring the dragon closer. The rest can stay. Something like this. Yeah. Start the combat and no mana. I mean, no, no spells. Let's also take retaliation. They come closer and now I can, now I can start hitting them. Perfect. Now I can start killing them as well. That was even better. Now there's a problem. But we may be able to solve that problem by putting a guy here. Oh, that sucked. I totally didn't see them. Hmm. Okay. Let's try this. Let's block them immediately so that they cannot shoot my shooters. And then I think we can go here. Nice. Then we can go and stay there, basically. We can also block these guys from above or from below. From above. You can... Why are you so slow? Oh, because there's no way to go here, yes. Okay, that hurt. That hurt like crazy. Go and protect them. Ouch. Continue here. Perfect. Perfect. That's that's beautiful. So now we now we still need to block them, right? And you will go after them. Wow, the, this is still gonna hurt a lot, and I will not have enough to fight. Uh, I will not have enough to fight the other guys, right? Yeah, so I will need I will need the undead troops, I believe. This is not going to work just with them. I mean, I will win. But uh Nice actually. Ouch. Ouch. Fine, come closer. 30 times 18 is 600 or something. We can't cast spells. Let's do 9 first. 60 times is 360. We can first start with them. Then these guys. Then wait. And then... 60 times 2, they can totally kill him. Nice. Okay. So we were able to save some army. What did we lose? We lost 5, that's acceptable. 3, acceptable. 20 and 11. I think all of this is acceptable, actually. All of this is acceptable. Now we can try to take... No, he has moved already. <laughs> okay, he has moved already. That's fine. But I think we need to bring more army. More undead army now. Because this is... This is still... Rather... 
rather difficult, isn't it? Is he even able to get to me? I don't think he is. He will go for the town and then... Then we'll see. Let's go. Okay. You are going to tell me more. Four and six, not much knowledge, so he shouldn't be casting too many spells on me. This guy, this guy can go more down, I would say. That town is protected. Yes, you stay where you are. We have full mana as well next turn. Oh, he is so scared that he does that. Interesting choice. Interesting choice. So now I need to actually go and kill them like that. Okay. Oh, I think we can do that. I think we can do that. Hmm. <laughs> There will be some uh, some strange play coming in soon. We have another plus combat speed artifact. Okay, so I could go through here. That's another another way to go. But I would need now the undead army. Otherwise, I am not able to do it, I think. So let's take this undead army from here. You, you, and you. So far, so good. Can't upgrade. But don't wanna, either. So do I have all the army? I think I still have some army in the third town. Yes, in this one. Yes, dragons and stuff. So maybe I can... Ah, two very, very slow guys. <laughs> oh, 7,000, but this, this is already enough, isn't it? I think it's enough. Yeah. So come closer and clan C, you can clan C, clan C, where are you? You can go here, take a few quick guys. Oh, you don't have any quick guys anymore? No, we lost all the quick guys, fine. So Clancy then take all of them. Nice. And give them to her. And like this. And like that. I think so. Very good Clancy. So... Clancy goes back so that he doesn't die. Stay there. And now she has very nice reinforcements. We can protect them like this. And like that. Yeah, we can protect the shooters. And everything will be all right. Let's go. This is a smaller one, by the way. So it should be even less problems. Yeah, we lost all the guys, which is not such a big problem. I want to lose them anyway. Right? 86 and 1. Glorious victory.
I mean, we can do better. Let's 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 try to do better, shall we? So Hmm. No, I'm fine with the quick result. I'm fine. We will sacrifice the unicorns as well. And go here. Ooh, that's a rather a lot of losses. Okay, so unicorns protect there. Actually, does not make too much sense. He doesn't have that much mana. I can... I have mana to do Chain Lightning. I can go even closer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, I can shoot from there without penalty. And I can actually also shoot from here without penalty. Where's the dragons? There are no dragons. So you kill them. You kill quite a few of these guys. Sounds good to me. Start the combat. I will do the chain lightning though on them or on them or on them like f hmm. 600 something. The chain lightning doesn't even do that much. This does more, right? 120 times a lot. I can also haste myself. What else can I do? I can bless myself, but I don't bless the... I will bless only them, basically. So, eight, seven... I am quicker as well. Can you shoot at them? No, only at these guys. Okay, go. And now since they can't shoot, I can protect my guys like this. Wait. Oh. And kick, kick. Nice, and kick the rest, almost. Now the biggest stack would be over here, but can't reach them. So let's go for destroy undead. Start with them, defend, defend, defend. Wait, wait, kill, and he flees. Excellent. I have killed my troops using the destroy undead. Was that worth it? I guess it was worth it. It actually wasn't worth it, but <laughs> let's pretend it was. And now this guy does not have enough to kill me, right? Aislin does not have does not have enough to, to do that. He does have enough to do something over here. So maybe we can hire a hero after I move. Oh, look at that. There's another town. What the? Can I reach it? Not with these heroes, that's for sure. Uh, I could hide you because you are not going to die anymore. So go inside. And now, uh, also tell me if you are able to go there. You are. 
So maybe we can go there with um, Ufretin because of stables, yes. Look, we can go there. We can make ourselves quicker as well. Don't need to. Take the town, Ufretin. Good job. Good job. Don't need the spell book. Do need stables, probably. Because with the stables, I can go here. No, I need the other hero to go there. Okay, it was, a, was worth a try. <laughs> Stay there. Maybe he will go back. So one town is protected and the other one is not yet protected. But Solmir and his uh, amazing chain lightning might be able to help us here. Let's do 12 of them in one stacks. And, uh, and two of them. Good job, Solmir. Learn stuff. Protect. Then you need to tell me what's over here. Archery. Well, I can't learn anything anyway anymore. So that's fine. We have spent all our money again. Uh, so let's leave people here. And I think we are practically done. Don't need to do anything else. Stay here. And uh, actually. Now that's fine. And you can also be a part of some kind of chain. Yeah, go there, Mephala. Okay, everybody's on their positions. I think we are going to be very, very successful here. I'm looking forward to that. I really am. This is speed 12. Can I get one? No. Now I can. That's it. Let's have a look. He goes there and glorious victory. I'm not even going to repeat that. Another glorious victory. And the red has been vanquished. Yes, <laughs> look at that people. Took one month and two days. And the red is no more. The red is no more. And now we have all the time in the world to try to go against those dragons. I think uh, there is no question about what are we going to build. We have three necromantic towns, so that's what we are going to do. I am going to take this still so that um, we can go through. Uh, but other than that, we just need to scout now and get mines, uh, level up uh, our mage guilds, because I think in at least a few towns we should be able to uh, get uh, uh, we should be able to get what am I trying to say resource silo cannot be built at least in a few towns we should be able to get level 4 magic I think so let's take this build a resource silo Okay, and in this one, next turn, cool, I love it. So that went actually even better than, than expected, even better than expected. Even better than not expected. <laughs> okay, I think I need to just finish this. 
how much time do we have? 20 minutes. Do you think we can finish in 20 minutes? Let's let's try to do so. Okay, and that's a big one too, again. Uh, they can shoot. I cannot... Uh, yeah, this will be difficult. What was the quick combat result? 118-3. I'm kind of okay with that, but let's try to do better. So they need to come to me, speed 7, speed 8, yeah. Yeah, they need to come to me. Let's give them something to shoot at. I mean, something to go after. And then you can shoot, you can shoot, but I want to also shoot at them. Mm. Speed 10, they will be able to go after them. So let's protect and protect. Yeah, something like that. Let's go. Very good. Wait. Oh, nice. Nice. That was not so nice. Now we can do some damage here or finish the, the guy. It's 300. No, let's finish. Let's finish him. That took a little bit, but no worries. The unicorn survived. Now we can take some damage there. These 10 are also super annoying. Let's start with them and continue. Oops. Can't do magic, right. Can't do magic. Well, I don't want to lose them. So let's go up. We will lose these guys, but it was kind of unavoidable. Three hundred something. Hmm. That sucks. We didn't wait, we shot at them, right? So if I don't go and protect them, they will attack or even they will attack. No matter what, we will lose a couple. Oh, nice. Was that a was that a high roll or something? Must have been a high roll. Maybe you want to shoot at them. No. Okay, then kill them. That was kind of to be expected. Go block, go wait, nice, nice, speed 8, speed 8, hmm, no, we need them to come closer to us. Even at the expense of finally losing that uh, first aid tent. Oops, didn't want to do that, but okay. So we lost liches and a couple of shooters. I guess that's okay. 
I guess that's okay. So now everything's uh, ready for taking and we definitely like that. So you need to go for this and that. You can flag this. Just looking at the map, what else needs to be flagged? Mephala, do you need to fight here? No. And then something's not flagged there, but that's all right. Okay, maybe you can go and help uh, also over here a little bit. Yeah, everybody go and help. Let's get quick units and uh, exchange them. Genova. You can go and give quick units also to Forgrim. And also to whoever is here, Clancy. Mm. Okay, Clancy can go and he actually needs to go closer to my main hero so that he can get some experience as well. We will need him to get experience. So he has offense, he has earth magic. And he probably needs wisdom. And after he has all that, he's uh, good to go. So yeah, you are going to be fighting for us. That's why you need to go this way. Gem can give him the army. This guy flags and flags. Coronius, ah yeah, we have a few people here. I don't think there is uh, anything to be had there. That's all right. So. Let's check what else we have. Maybe I should just uh, pause the recording here and uh, come back to you when, when we have built everything because um, this is not going to... Yeah, this there is no enemy on the map. I just need to visit... Well, first of all, build all the mage guilds, then visit all the mage guilds, and then... Uh, and then go for the then build the army and then go for the dragons right so this is gonna take a while i think it makes perfect sense to to just uh, pause the recording here yeah so let's uh, save this is uh, i don't know end of scenario whatever and we have 12 more minutes, so after I have built everything and uh, visited all the mage guilds and prepared for the final fight, we will be back. And we're back. So unfortunately there are no level 4 mage guilds in this scenario either, I have misremembered that. But we have learned uh, Earthquake and I think protection from Earth Magic on top of uh, what we had before. I have also moved all the unupgraded army from these two towns, one and two, and we are going to upgrade it uh, next turn here in the third one. So let's end the turn. I have also visited the plus one defense, plus one offense over there. Plus one spell power here, and uh, that's about it, I think. Uh, I also gave archery to Clancy, that was here. And now let's go. So, first, uh, the dragons need to come to gem. Come, switch, and let's uh, slow it down a little bit. Now she can open the red border guard and go this way and also deal with the 
genies, right? So let's split. Don't lose anything like this and take the blue border guard. That allows us to exchange the army here with Coronius. Coronius opens the blue guard and goes through here. That teleports him straight into the town where he can upgrade the army. So let's upgrade the bone dragons, the black knights, liches, vampires and let's also hire some more so these guys them and looks like we will not have much more money yeah that's it so we will not take these guys or maybe we can take them as fodder why not uh, now i don't have money for some reason okay let's uh, exchange a little bit of resources for money so that we can afford another hero ah solmir or Malcolm. Let's take our good friend Solmir and give him everything and uh, maybe one quick unit on this guy as well. Okay, then Solmir will be moving the army uh, up to Clancy because Clancy uh, needs to level up, right? So, I could give you seven more guys right there. And that's not such a bad idea, right? Let's go and switch again. Put them together. You can go to this guy. Uh, take his stuff. Now he has seven of those, plus all the artifacts right now. He can also take... Uh, all this okay and uh, Clancy split them the rest doesn't matter one two three four five yes so you guys on the sides you guys on sides like this you in the middle and let's go. We need a couple of levels up to level 15. I want the expert turf magic. I want wisdom. I want uh, some other stuff potentially as well. Air magic and maybe tactics. We'll see. So let's go. Actually, let's save over here and go. That's fine. Basic armorer. Hmm. No expert offense. Advanced archery. Okay. And death ripple, I think we already know that. We could build uh, buy something in the black market. I will not. We'll go straight for the dragon utopia, I guess. You, Genova, can also come and help. Make some people quick, like Clancy. This is speed 12, yes, so you can make him quick and bring the army closer over there and you can, you are all quick, right? Yes, so there's nothing else to do here, you can go and uh, go down next turn, now Solmir. Hmm. We don't need to do anything here, right? Genova, give uh, stuff to this guy. And also go and have a look if there is anything there. There is actually a pendant of total recall there. Interesting. Interesting. You can take that as well. It will be sacrificed. You guys together. We don't want to lose shooters. And one stacks like this, Clancy, get something sweet, right? That's fine, expert archery. And we get boots of polarity, boots of levitation, shield of the dam and greater scales of the basilisk. Okay, not the greatest utopia I've ever seen, but it will have to do, I guess. It will have to do. That's all right, we have the shield. And we have the spell power extra. 
so that's fine. And then Genova will again make you quick and uh, transport the army all the way over here. Do I need for to go for the Naga Bank? No, I don't. Syra can take the army and give it to you. Gem, Gem, you will go after the genies. Don't need that. Let's have a look. What does the scholar give us? Plus one attack skill. Not bad. Not bad. Let's go forward. And also lots of these guys. Doesn't matter. Let's go for another attack skill. Something over there maybe. That's fine. You can go closer. Stay here. And you can just give... Uh, it doesn't matter, right? Go and have a look. We cannot do anything good there. So that's fine. Next turn. Uh, you can... Oh, what? Suddenly the smell of death is overwhelming. Ambush, screams one of your troops, pointing at the sky. Didn't expect that. <laughs> Didn't expect that. Uh, we actually want to reload and give the experience to to the other guy. Totally unexpected. That's the autosave, right? Yes. So let's wait. And you will need to go, right? Syrah, just move back a little bit. You have all the artifacts, yes. And you can go there. Like this. And take uh, attack skill. And now you'll need to wait, unfortunately. But that's alright. That's alright, we don't need to do anything else. So you stay, you stay. And everybody else is fine. So end the turn, then you can switch the army, much better, Clancy, and let's go save, number three, and we go here, 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 there there okay clancy you have visited this right yes let's go okay so let's see what we can do we go first and we do have a slow so let's slow them now they don't reach we can wait with everybody and do it like this like that nice maybe some more over here perfect then how many can you kill 1.5 damage that's about 10 let's go after these guys ouch okay then we need to haste as well i would say what are what is their speed speed 9 speed 10 okay so we do have better speed Maybe we can... We do have better speed on everybody, except for Power Liches. Uh, which is okay. Let's haste one of them, see what, uh, what can be done. Let's try 9 over here, almost. Then 20 over there. Again a little bit more and then okay you couldn't yeah <laughs> you couldn't do that that's fine finish them and finish them okay much better losses let's take wisdom as well oh scouting would be so good i guess scouting would be so good but let's go wisdom because i need oh come on i need 
I need earth magic. We can get one more level. Expert, 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 expert. Okay, we need one more level for expert earth magic. <laughs> right, so where is my teacher? Oh, my teacher was left behind. That's not cool. I should have moved you long ago, but fine. We can, uh, we can still do that. So now you need to go here, Shrine of Magic Fault, um, and learn Destroy Undead, sure. Then you can go here, and you can sacrifice all this junk over here that we do not need. And this as well, and that, and uh, sacrifice. OMG. I mean, tactics is also so cool. Let's take tactics, actually. Because uh, we will need tactics and uh, who knows what skill we will get next. So the last one remaining, probably, probably scouting would be very good on him. And of course, maybe air magic. We'll see. Okay, so now you have reached uh, all the levels. So maybe we can uh, maybe we can do the final fight with her. She's nice, right? Uh, like this. Okay, and gem goes does the final fight with all the artifacts as well. Because why not? <laughs> Gem, go and uh, do the fight. Let's save here. All right. Horde of Ghost Dragons. Yeah, we are already a bit over time, but let's continue. Bam. Despite the pleasant surroundings, the unmistakable odor of death permeates the area. You see a group of gross dragons ahead. And we can totally finish them. I will not even repeat the fight. No need to. And we can go here. And now we just need uh, this guy to teach us some uh, good spells and we'll be done. So let's end the turn. Coronius goes everywhere he can, anywhere he can, and teach Clancy. Air Shield, Anti-Magic, Earthquake, Fireball, Force Field, Forgetfulness, Frost Ring. I could have, if I knew that, actually, I could have uh, level him up and give him also the um, level 4 spell, but he has knowledge too, so <laughs> that's not gonna, not gonna work anyway. So I don't, I'm not interested in transferring the, well, actually, I, I, I have still have this guy. So can we get a level somewhere? How much? 1,200. I can get a level here. Oh. Yeah, let's actually do that. I mean, it's one more turn. Who cares, right? Let's do it. Okay, so you can go here and uh, Gem will give you some artifacts and you can start uh, sacrificing them. Bam, Boots of Polarity maybe. Expert Wisdom, Expert Scholar, nice, nice. Okay, so that's it. Now you can teach Clancy again. You can take your artifacts back. Oops, like this. Gem. Go here. And Coronius goes, gives us Chain Lightning and Slayer. Perfect. If we ever needed it. And uh, go here as well. And now who wants to pick up the artifact? Gem, of course. Let's save as end of the scenario. And uh, here we are. Buried under the gems and gold of the Ghost Dragon's Horde, you find the amulet of the Undertaker. I 
excellent. So this is uh, end of episode five, right? Save. And when we come back, we will be retrieving the vampire scowl. Thank you very much for watching, people. See you next time. Bye bye.